What's up guys, my name is Mike Malone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to go over cycle detection on HackerRank. So basically, if you have a link list of 1, 2, 3, and then, uh, then 2, here in this case, what our function is trying to do is we're trying to return true if we have a cycle, and uh, false if we don't. So when we mean by cycle, it means that when we traverse through this list, we get back to a node that we already seen before. So if I have head, I go to two, I go to three, and then three, I go back to two. I already seen this two, therefore there's a cycle. It means there's like a loop here. So you can have like multiple cycles. Um, let's say I had like one, two, and two goes back to one. This is a cycle because if I were to traverse through one, I would go back to one and I've already seen one. So that's a cycle. So basically any like loops inside your link list. So if I had like three, and this goes back to here, this is a cycle. Because if I go to one, two, and then three, three goes back to one, then that's a cycle. Okay, so how do you do this problem? Um, simplest way is actually just to have two pointers, one called fast and one slow. So let's say we have uh, our cycle right here. I'm gonna have a fast pointer and uh, a slow pointer. So this is gonna be slow, and then we're gonna have fast right here also. So fast is just gonna go twice as fast. So what it's gonna do is, on the first iteration, uh, slow is gonna go to the next node, right? Only going by once, so this is gonna be slow. And then fast is gonna go twice as fast. So fast is gonna go dot next dot next, so fast is gonna go here, right? It jumps twice as fast. It goes originally more here, it goes to here now. Now, um, after that, slow is gonna go to the next node, so slow is gonna go here. And fast is gonna jump twice as fast. So fast is gonna jump, uh, goes to two, and then it's gonna jump again back to three. So fast is gonna stay where it is. So then if, uh, if our slow node is ever equal to the same node as the fast node, it is basically, it would have a cycle. And this always works because if you were to always traverse twice as fast, um, sooner or later you, you're gonna get to the same node if there is a cycle, right? If we're traversing one time down the list and uh, the second time in the faster pointer is going twice as fast, if there is a cycle, it's going to meet somewhere in the middle, right? Because we're just going, we're looping backwards, right? If it's not, if, if it reaches the end and it never meet, met each other, then that means that there was no cycle. So um, here's the code for it. We have slow and then we have fast pointing ahead. While fast is not equal to null and slow is not equal to null and uh, fast next is not equal to null because uh, Fast, since fast is going twice as fast, we have to check if fast next is not equal to null. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna set, set slow is gonna equal to slow is next, and we're gonna set fast is going to equal to fast next dot next. Then um, if fast is ever equal to slow, we return true. Um, otherwise, when we reach the end, we just return false. So yeah, that's pretty much the gist of this code. It's not that much difficult. Um, another way you could do is you could just hash every single pointer to every node you see and see if you've seen it again. If you've seen it again, then yeah, then that means that there's a there's a loop. But yeah, uh, that's pretty much the gist of this. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe. I'll check you guys later. Peace.